Tomorrow's World doesn't have a gardening correspondent, so for today, it'll have to be me. And our word for all those reluctant husbands breaking their backs over the weeds, your troubles are over. You don't have to have green fingers anymore to make your garden the envy of the neighbourhood. The latest thing of plastic flowers looks just as good as the real thing from the other side of the fence. From close up, it can even smell like the real thing if you go over it with a scent spray. And one good thing about these, unlike the real thing, they don't fade and wither away. Just a touch of aerosol polish, once over quickly with a duster, and they come up looking like new. And the nice thing is, you can have your favorite flowers in and out of season. Now, if you don't balk at the idea of sticking plastic flowers in your lawn, but haven't got a lawn to stick them into, the latest thing in garden technology may be the answer to your problem. It's this stuff. Plastic grass. The tufts are made of polypropylene, and they're woven onto a base made of the same substance. And you don't have to roll it, mow it, seed it, or do any of the things you're supposed to do for 500 years to end up with an English lawn like a billiard table that everybody else envies. It's been used for golf and tennis tournaments, and it's even had an international football match played on it. The makers claim it wears better than the real thing. And of course, the weather has no effect on it whatsoever. Of course, from time to time, it will get a bit dirty. And if it does, you just reach for tomorrow's world's replacement for all those tools in the garden shed, a vacuum cleaner. Of course, if you're a stickler for detail, you can also buy plastic worms, plastic birds, plastic fountains, plastic garden chairs, and there you have it. A 100% multi-seasonal plastic English garden, all year round, anywhere you have the space for it. <laughs>